Hello friend, this question is from test series number one. It's subject is control system. Topic name is time domain analysis. It's a one marks problem. Okay, the question says that uh, for a transfer function given below, uh, find out the output response for impulse input. Okay, so that is fine at time is equal to two second, but with the help of approximate analysis. Okay, so you, you are not required to just calculate the output. You need to out find the output using approximate analysis. So what is the approximate analysis? Uh, first of all, just look at the transfer function. 24 upon s square 14 s 24 we can easily find out the root of it it is will be s plus 2 into s plus 12 okay so in the approximate analysis what we do first of all we convert the transfer function into the time constant form that is take the two common convert the transfer function into the time constant form s by 12 plus 1 take a 12 common also so it will be like 24 upon 24 and 1 plus s by 2 and 1 plus s by 12 okay then after the time constant form that approximate analysis says that if the if the pole if the ratio of the pole ratio of the dominant pole and the other pole is greater than 5 if the ratio of the pole if like if you have this pole p1 which is nearer to the y axis and then you have a pole p2 right then your if your p1 by p2 or if you like if, you, if your p2 by p1 is greater than 5 then the effect of p2 into the system will be very very less or such that you can actually ignore the p2 and your transfer function is not going to affect or your output response is not going to affect if you just calculate a system using p1 because you know by the uh, stability criteria we know that the effect of the pole over the system will be as greater as nearer it is from the y axis or imaginary axis right so here you can see that we have two pole 1 2 and 1 12 and 12 by 2 is 6 which is greater than 5 so i can actually ignore the effect of pole 12 but you can only affect you can only ignore the poles in the time constant form okay so we will affect the we will ignore the effect of 12 because it is very far so my new transfer function or approximate transfer function will be 1 upon 1 plus s by 2 which is basically 2 upon s plus 2 this is my new transfer function okay now question says that uh, if the input is unit impulse okay if the input is unit impulse so your xt will be unit impulse so your x is the Laplace transform of the unit impulse is 1 so your output response ys will be x is into the system response let's say tf s in our case so which is 1 into 2 upon s plus 2 so your yt will be basically 2 into e raised to power minus 2t but question says that calculate the response at t is equal to 2 second so let's put the t is equal to 2 2 into e raised to power minus 4 which is turns out as 36.63 milli into 10 to the power minus 3 or 0 0.03663 okay this is your response so we have calculated the response the time constant form and the effect of the dominant pole it is very 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 important concept in the control systems okay every year if not we'll say now every year but in the recent year we have observed the problem based on this concept very frequently in last year also 2014 also uh, we have got the problem on the one or two sets based on this and the previous years also in gate 2012 also and subsequently years also we have find the problem based on the time constant form it's a very beautiful concept please consider this as a very important concept thank you